Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is the first time watching, my name is Joaquin. I'm so excited guys, because this month is Pride Month. By all means, if you want to know how I created this rainbow pride look, keep on watching. start by priming my face and for this guys I'm gonna use the no pore blend primer I actually love this it's uh, smooth just like that guys I spread it all over my face smoothly I love love this primer it's actually one of my favorites it's creamy smooth it has a nice aroma and it feels so 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 smooth guys so now I'm gonna do my eyebrows. For this, it is gonna take me a while. It takes me about 30 minutes to do both eyebrows just to make sure they're straight and even. I'm also gonna add all the products I've used for this look underneath the description box. So in case you're interested in one of the products, by all means, you can check them out. So I'll be right back. Guys, I think I did my eyebrows a little bit too thick. No problemo, no problemo. I'm gonna go ahead and fix them with concealer. And for that, I'm gonna be using C10 from Jeffree Star. I'm just gonna spread some on my hand, just like that. So after 45 minutes doing my eyebrows, guys, I'm back. And now I'm gonna set my concealer with the new setting powder Jeffree Star. This is just to set the concealer underneath my eyebrows just like that guys. This setting powder does have a nice like a candy crush, candy crush, candy crush. Yeah, cotton candy. So for this look guys I'm gonna be using the James Charles palette. Why did I choose this one is because I feel it has all the colors that I'm going to be needing for this pride look. This is the one guys, the very, very famous palette that always goes out of stock. And as you can tell, I haven't used it that much. Yes. Let's create magic. Hi, how are ya? I put that uh, Jeffree Star's introduction. Hi, how are ya? It's so iconic. So I'm gonna start with my right eye. I'm gonna do red, orange, yellow, and then on my left side, I'll do what's the darker colors, green, blue, purple, pink. No, that's on the other side, right? With this side. Okay, yeah, whatever. I'm gonna start off with this red color. Now for the next color, I'm adding orange. And I'm gonna try to blend it in very, very good. Next, I'm gonna apply the yellow. I can use the same brush. And for this, I bought this little uh, brush cleaner that removes the all the excessive of the eyeshadow, just like that. And you see, it's nice and clean. That way, I don't get red or orange when I'm applying the yellow. Now with a clean brush, you just wanna blend those three colors together. Just like that. So I'm gonna add, underline my eye with the same colors. I'll start with the red. And at the end, I'll do black eyeliner. And what I did on this, I, I'm gonna do it on my left side with darker colors, purple, green, and blue. You wanna make sure you're careful with darker colors because 
once you apply it and you mess up, well, you're fucked. It is what it is, like many MUSS. Now I'm gonna add some blue. So now that I have all those three colors, I'm gonna get a clean brush and I'm gonna blend in. Just like that, guys. So now I'm gonna underline my eye with the same colors I used. I'm now gonna highlight underneath my eyebrows using the Northern Lights from Jeffree Star. I'm gonna be using Alaskan Eyes, just like that. Just tap it. So now, the hard part, cutting my crease. And for that, guys, I'm not gonna be able to talk because it does get me a little bit nervous just in case I, yeah, I mess up. I'm gonna be using the new Jeffree Star uh, concealer, shade C0. It's basically white. Actually, I like this for uh, when I do my creases and all that. And if you see guys, I just add just what I'm gonna use. I did try to do them nice and even, nicely done, which I think I nailed it, to be honest with you guys. I'm just gonna let it uh, sit for a while, let it dry, so that way I can uh, set it with some setting powder. So I believe it's nice and dry, so I'm gonna use the same setting powder from Jeffree Star. Just like that, guys. So for my crease, guys, I'm gonna be using my Blue Blood Palette from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. So now that I already set my white shimmer on my half crease, I was thinking of outlining my crease with some gray glitter. I think I'm gonna do this off camera, guys, because I think I'm gonna be shaking. Now I'm gonna look stupid. So I'll be right back. So now, eyeliner. The reason why I'm more into these kind of eyeliners, guys, is because it makes it easier for me and it doesn't smear as much as the liquid eyeliner does, so I'm gonna be using this benefit. So now that I'm, my eyes are done, now we're going with foundation, and I'll be using NARS in the shade of Medium 4 Barcelona. I'm gonna apply one, two, three, four, five, six pumps. So for concealer, I'm gonna be using Tarte in medium sand. Just gonna add just a little bit because it is full coverage. A little bit about me, guys. I've been doing makeup for 14 years now. Started social media last year, and finally, last month, I just got certified as a makeup artist. I am super, super, super excited, guys, that now that I'm certified, I get to do more things, different things with makeup, different projects. So now I'm gonna set my concealer with setting powder. I am gonna be using the same Jeffree Star uh, setting powder in beige. So 
So for contouring, I'm gonna be using my favorite, favorite uh, Studio Fix. I'm just gonna apply on my cheeks. Cheeks. On my cheeks. What do you guys think? So far so good. And I'm gonna set my makeup with the Anastasia Dewey set. So I'm gonna be using the new Anastasia Loose Highlighter in the shade of So Hollywood. For this, I always wet my brush, just one bump of setting spray. So for lips guys, I'm gonna be using one of my favorites from Too Faced, very uh, natural shade, and it's totally matte. So the fact that I have so much on my eyes, I want my eyes to stand out, so I'm gonna add much more uh, natural light color on my lips. Guys, we have come to an end. This is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. If you made it to the end of this video, guys, thank you so much for your love and your support. If you guys have not yet subscribed to my channel, you need the drill. Subscribe, turn on the little bell so you can get notifications every time I post a video. Once again, guys, thank you so much for watching. See you next time.